Hey my beauties, welcome back to my channel. So today, as you guys can see, I will be showing you guys how to do this look. I personally really, really fell in love with it. I used a bunch of new products, so I hope you guys are excited for that. But more than anything, I wanted to do something a little bit different than your usual warm tones. So I went with this cool tone eyeshadow look and oh, I really, really love it. It makes me want to play more with cool tones because now that I see it on me, I think I can rock it, I guess. <laughs> but let me know what else you guys would like to see as far as holiday eye looks or just in general any type of look. Let me know in the comments section. That way I can start playing with colors and see what I can come up with for you guys. But other than that, my loves, if you guys are new to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe. Just click the button and you will be part of this family and be updated with my future videos. And as well, don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up if you guys are excited for the holidays or in general just love this makeup look. But other than that, my loves, Let's go ahead and get started with this makeup look. All right, so to begin, I'm gonna be using this primer from Makeup Forever. This is their step one skin equalizer and this is the base mattifying primer because we want our face to be matte. And then for my foundation, I'm gonna be using this one from Benefit. This is their uh, what is this called again? I forgot what they're... Play sticks, that's what they're called, play sticks, I forgot. But I'm gonna be using the shade Jump Rope. I used to, back in the day, use teacup, and that was actually my first foundation, and that's the foundation I used throughout high school because that was the foundation that I would steal from my mom. Um, which, by the way, I don't even know if you guys still wanna see that video of how I did my makeup in high school. Let me know if you guys do wanna see that. Leave me a comment down below. But yeah, this is the foundation I'm gonna be using, and like I said, I'm using the shade Jump Rope. And to blend it out, I'm gonna be using my Sigma 3D HD Blender. Now for my concealer, I'm gonna be using this one from Tarte. This is the Shape Tape Con Contour Concealer, and I'm using the shade Light Neutral. Now I'm gonna take my Tarte Pro Glow Palette and I'm actually gonna be contouring, cream contouring. So I'm gonna go ahead and take Shade, which is this one right here, and I'm just gonna go ahead and contour with it. All right, now to set it, I'm gonna be taking my Laura Mercier translucent powder as always, and I'm gonna go ahead and just start baking with this. And then I'm gonna take my Hula bronzer from Benefit to set everywhere where I have cream contour. Now I'm gonna go ahead and remove it with this brush from Morphe. This is the Y1, and oh my god, can we just talk about the packaging? It's so pretty. Um, I do have a coupon code with Morphe, which is Birdie, so it can get you guys a discount on their site, but yeah, this is the brush I'm gonna be using to remove all this powder now. Now I'm gonna go ahead and do my brows really quickly with this um, brow pencil from Benefits, the Precisely My Brow. I'm gonna use the shade five, and we're gonna move on straight to our eyes. Okay, so next I'm gonna go ahead and take the Urban Decay Naked Basics Ultimate Basics palette, and I'm gonna go ahead and start out with the color Faith, which is this one right here, and apply this as my transition color. And I'm gonna be applying it with the Y15 Morphe brush. Next, I'm gonna take the Urban Decay Full Spectrum palette, and I, oh my god, this palette has a lot of gorgeous. Colorful eyeshadows. Um, here, let me show you. Look at these colors, they're so pretty. I'm feeling cool tones since I'm always doing warm tones, so I think I'm gonna go ahead and use the color Iced, which is this one right here. I think I'm gonna go with this one and apply this all over my entire lid. Also, I'm gonna spray a little bit of Fix Plus to my brush to make it more intense.
All right, so I'm, just, I'm stopping right there because I want to add a dark blue eyeshadow, which is this one. This one is called, what is it called? Mink. So I think I'm going to be adding mink to the outer part of the eye and then sort of blending it in with another blue or mixing these two shades together to kind of like blend this line out, okay? Next, we're gonna take a little bit of our transition color again and blend out our crease. Next, I'm gonna take a black eyeliner. This one is from the Estee Lauder from Victoria Beckham collaboration. And I'm gonna go ahead and take black Saffron um, and just line my eyes. And then taking that dark blue eyeshadow again, we're gonna be applying this on our lower lash line. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and take my Sigma Wicked Gel Liner and do a wing liner with this. So now I'm gonna go ahead and add my mascara. This is a new one from Tarte. It's called Man Eater. And I'm pretty excited because I usually always love their brushes. Um, and this one's a little bit thicker, so we shall see how it works out. And for my lashes, I'm gonna be using these from Violet Voss. These are in the style Just Slaying, which are so cute. I'm so excited to use these because they look like they're that type of dolly kind of lash. So. I'm gonna be using these. So while I let my lashes dry, I'm gonna go ahead and finish off the rest of my face makeup. So I'm gonna go ahead and add a blush and a highlighter. So for my blush, I'm gonna go ahead and use the Benefit Rocketeur blush because you guys know this is my favorite blush. So for my highlight, I'm gonna be using this little tiny highlighter from Jouer. This one is in the colored ice. This is from their holiday collection, I believe. And mine, unfortunately, when I received mine, it broke, as you guys can see. But uh, it still works. I have half of it, so we're gonna be using this. And to highlight, I'm gonna be using the Morphe Y14 brush. Now I'm going to go ahead and finish off with the lips and I'm going to go ahead and first line them with this lip pencil from Bella Pure Cosmetics and this is their gel lip liner and the color is cinnamon so I'm first going to be lining them with this. And then for the liquid lipstick I'm going to be using this one from Pure Cosmetics in collaboration with JD Weighty 180 <laughs> and this is in the color Cake. All right, my love, so this is the finished look. I really hope you guys liked it. And if you did, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up. You guys always help me if you guys do. And as well, don't forget to subscribe before you leave. That way you are updated with my future videos and you join our family. But other than that, my loves, thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I love you guys and I'll see you guys on the next video. Bye. Mwah. I'm missing a nail. Sigma 3D. Next, I'm gonna go ahead. Ooh. Cause I'm loco. Eso. Damn. What if. I think the black eyeliner will. Whatever. Eyelashes make everything better, so it will be okay. We will survive this, okay? Okay. Okay, okay. Not oh my god. This is so pretty.